Imagine going even faster than that and being very, very low to the ground. What have you got? Thrust SSC. Thrust SSC, or supersonic car, has been designed by Richard Noble with two ideas in mind. First, to beat the current land speed record, which he already holds, and second, to go beyond that and be the first car to break the sound barrier. We first saw Thrust on Blue Peter as a full-size model in the studio. Since then, Richard and his team have been working full out to turn their plans into reality. And the race was also on to find a driver for the car. After a series of tests, RAF pilot Andy Green was chosen for his split-second reactions and he took me out for a spin at supersonic speed in an RAF tornado. All they had to do was get thrust SSC ready in time. Work continued over the summer and everything seemed to be in place for the first run in the Nevada desert in September. Any later and the rain would literally mean the attempt would be a washout. So what happened Richard? Well Tim, it didn't quite work out as we hoped. Um, basically the problem was money. What was happening was we were working really hard during the summer trying to bring in as much money as we could to get yeah. the car finished. It wasn't coming in fast enough, we couldn't finish the car. But as you can see, it's very nearly finished now, so we're, we're not so far away. So does this mean that the American competitors have got ahead now? Well, you would have thought so, because basically they've now got their car completed. But the extraordinary thing is they've completed the car, the desert is now dry, and they've put it in a museum. And why have they done that? Beats me. Mad. But, but they've, lost, they've, they've lost that opportunity, so, you know, we're okay. So do you think you've still got the edge? I think we have, yes, because we're now, um, we'll have the car finished by uh, uh, February now, we're running by February, so, you know, it's really neck and neck now. Have you decided which desert it's going to be? We're looking at uh, a number of sites which are actually dry in the spring, because the Black Rock Desert is wet in the spring, which are dry in the spring where we can run. And we're looking at these in a number of countries at the moment. There's of people taking photographs at the moment. Yep, um, that's right. They're all out with Land Rovers and, uh, you know, they're measuring the surface hardness and so on. So can uh, you tell me which uh, desert is well, going to Well, I be? don't want the Americans to find out. <laughs> I, I've got a sneaking suspicion it's Blackpool Beach. <laughs> is there anything I can do to help? Yeah, well, there is actually, really. We're here basically to generate cash for the project yeah. to get us through for the next phase. I thought you'd like a ride in the Dera Simulator here. Yeah, this is. is the cost of... There is actually a cost of £10 for this, but the money all goes 100% to the project. Well, good. And Alex is running it here for you. Thanks, Hello. Richard. This is the actual simulator that Andy Green is practicing in at the moment. Yes. Can I have a go? Yes, indeed. OK, this will be the nearest I get to the land speed record. What do I need to do? Uh, if you turn the batteries on. Batteries on. Then turn on both the computers. Computer 1 and computer 2. Now you can start the left engine. Left engine on. And the right engine. Right engine now on. Right, if you arm the safety systems. Arm the safety it's all very exciting stuff, up it goes. And the parachute and the abort. Very important, the parachute. Abort. There. Okay, now if you take your foot off the brake and fall down on the throttle. Here we go. Right, we're actually moving now. I see the desert zooming past. I'm about middle now. You've done one mile now. I've done a mile. Yeah. All in a matter of seconds. Right, it's quite difficult trying Two to keep it in the middle. Two miles now. Yes, it is Two quite miles. fast. I think I'm doing quite well now. Three miles. Wow. And what's the markers? Markers four, four miles. So, so this, ne this next mile. mile is your measured mile and it starts go. now. Right. Okay, this is exciting stuff. I'm steering it. I'm you. steering it. Pass the flag. What time did I do? 813 miles an hour. Not bad. If you want to have a go at this simulator, it's at the Motor Show at London's Earls Court for the next nine days. Where are the brakes? <laughs> hey, I hope you find those brakes. <laughs>